Hey guys, so today we're gonna be Schneller bridging in Bedwars. Well, for those who don't know, Schneller bridging is basically ninja bridge, but you let go of shift faster on every block to make like a faster version of ninja bridge. And also, am I pronouncing this right? Like, is it Schneller bridging? Because <laughs> it's kind of weird. Alright, let's just go with it. is actually pretty fast and for those of you who don't know uh you guys can see the bottom right um i've included the the shift key so you guys can see every time whenever i press shift because you know it's been um suggested by many of you because sometimes like i just got bridge and on the side uh, or like on the edges i just press like shift and people think it's safe walk so i guess i'm just gonna be including that and this guy what how did he not die all right so we killed him really quick okay just gonna be getting some stuffs. So yeah, um, when I first heard about Schneller bridging, it's from a bed another Bedwars YouTuber called a uh, Lu Cape. Actually, speaking about this YouTuber, um, when I first saw his channel, I thought um, the name is pronounced as Luca IP instead of Lu Cape, but um, every other YouTuber just referred to him as Lu Cape. So I'll just go with that. And we're also gonna be going over the definition of Schneider bridging, but first off, I'm gonna get, get this guy out really quick. Oh my god. Okay, I'm so bad at Bedwars PvP. Okay, I'm going to take the stuff, I'm gonna avoid it really quick, so yeah. So by definition, um, Schneeler is a German word, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, so Schneeler basically means more quickly, faster, rapid. So like when someone say Schneeler bridge, then it probably means like a faster bridge or something like that. But yeah, um, I'm not quite sure who really invented this bridging method. Um, like, I've tried to search it up, but I can't really find anything on YouTube. For me, it is basically the same as... It's the same as, um, ego bridging. And ego bridging is already covered in Teddy Nader's, uh, video. Like, that was uploaded four years ago. All Bedwars, I mean, all bridging method video. So that's, like, when I first heard about, like, you know, something like this type of bridging. Well, for me, they're basically the same. All right, um, let's get the last yellow guy really quick. This should be a really easy game so far. I haven't really struggled with anyone yet, so... Did it just... What? Okay, this guy bought a bow. <laughs> is this like... <laughs> is this uh, what it's like in Bedwars 2020? Like, everyone gets uh, just bows and KB stick? All right, let me just bonk this guy really quick. So, uh, I guess, you know, since Teddy Nair's video was uploaded like four years ago on, like, ego bridging, I'm assuming he is the real inventor of this bridging method, and where did this- <gasps> Oh yeah, so, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, because I'm not sure, okay? So, feel free to leave. Um, alright, that was last game, and now we're on to our second game. We're also gonna be Schneeler bridging, or ego bridging. This guy didn't do- Oh, this just feel like one of those Godbridge rushes. I don't know if this guy is too slow or is it just like I'm too fast, but still though, um... We're gonna do our little bad defense. The thing is that I haven't really practiced this bridging. Like when I bridge, it's so hard for me to like concentrate and talk, so yeah. And also guys, I don't know if I'm doing this right, like... Do you guys think this is fast enough? Like I know, like it's kind of, it's kind of hard to differentiate between like Schneeler bridging and the normal ninja bridging. 
like for me <laughs> because like i've been like godridge rushing bedworth for like whole my whole life and i know for sure this is definitely faster than brizzly but even but still to myself this is still kind of slow for me okay guys i don't want to offend anyone just that compared to the godridge speed it is like a little bit slow but still it's, okay is this what everyone do these days in hypixel like they don't want to do like fighting they just don't want to fight they just tower up i don't know man um but yeah, um, it's just I haven't ninja bridge in a while, and it's not as fast compared to like god bridging, so that's why. Cause that was pretty good. Is this guy gonna do anything about me breaking his bed? Right, that pick right was a little bit extra, but oh wait, wh where is this guy going? Oh my, oh my god, dude, this guy, this guy. Okay, all this guy knows is just to go up. It's just up, 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 up. That's like the only thing in his mind when he's playing bed wars. <laughs> I don't really have a problem with this so but like it just it's just kind of annoying <laughs> I don't know if it's I don't know how you guys feel about that but yeah I don't know if people just do this a lot in bed these days this guy gonna drop okay he's gonna drop <gasps> okay yes I trade him yes let's go GG's GG's okay I am making my way over so this guy over there Oh my god, we almost fell off that was And this guy bought a bow too And this guy bought a bow Oh my I'm, I'm, And that's a punch bow And it's a punch bow Dude, this whole <laughs> I'm so done guys Alright man oh, Okay, this is Unbelievable 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 <laughs> I just can't it's literally the second game like this is a game right after the first one and am I is this the same guy? I'm not sure but yeah, however, okay, so back to the topic. I still agree with Luke Cape um, uh, This point where he talked about how it is like faster than Grizzly bridging and safer Yeah, of, of course this guy bought a bow because this guy just can't PvP <laughs> Well, I do agree with Luke Cape's point on this. Um, it's definitely faster than Brizzly and safer than Godridge. For most people, but not me. <laughs> if you guys um, watch my stream and maybe some video, you're gonna see that um, my Moonwalk and Godridge is actually more consistent than my Ninja Bridge. <laughs> it's kind of it's kind of hilarious, but that's the truth. But for most people, for most people, I feel like Schneeler, Schneeler Bridging would be a really um, good option. I feel like, yeah, Schneeler Bridging, definitely, definitely a German word, like, <laughs> like uh, for those who don't know, I'm actually bilingual, I speak both English and Mandarin, and as far as I know, like, this pronunciation, like, Schnee, like, it's not in any of these two languages that I've learned, so, <laughs> please don't make fun of me if I'm pronouncing this in a weird way, like, it's, wait, 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 no, 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 hey, yo, yo, no! You know, Bedwars has been really dumb today, like, <laughs> it's been, <laughs> it's not been really nice to me, but uh, yeah. Um, so today's video is gonna be mainly focused on bridging. So uh, even for me, I do believe that under a lot of circumstances in Bedwars, um, God bridging is not as useful. So if you really, really want to God bridge rush in Bedwars, you need to be really consistent. Like, let's say you could reach the other island in like 15 seconds with god bridging, but if you fall, counting the spawn time and the time for you to run out to get to the bridge, it's still gonna be slower than like a consistent, slow ninja bridger. So, yeah, you need to be really consistent. So, if you're not consistent enough, just don't god bridge, it's not worth it. Maybe you can flex it. You know, you can just like flex on your friends in housing and do stuff like that, but for... Okay, this guy is just destroying his bridge. I'm gonna send him a fireball just so that he thinks that I'm still gonna rush him through his base, but what I'm actually gonna do is that I'm going to go to the base next to him and rush him from the side. So, um, so after you practice enough, so let's say you think you're consistent enough, you don't fall that often in bed worse, um, there are still many things to work on. So um, in my um, Godbridge tutorial, I did talk about how you have to aim at specific points. And for those of you that can Godbridge, you definitely know that you need to aim at a specific coordinate for Godbridge to work. I don't know what this guy is doing. He is, and this guy pulled a bow too. Okay, I'm so done, guys. This is unbelievable. This is, I'm, I'm, I'm. Okay, I'm purling in. I'm done. I'm, I'm triggered, guys. I'm actually triggered.
<laughs> this is the third guy, literally the third person with a bow. I'm done, I'm done. Yeah, good fight, good fight. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Yeah, GG's, GG's. Next game. So, um, I'm back. This is gonna, probably gonna be the last game. I actually uh, took a break for like about 10 minutes just so that I don't keep queuing into these people that just keeps buying bows and stuff because I literally can't. And how do you guys like my Badline cosmetic? <laughs> Alright, anyways. Yeah, guys, this is one of the rare footage of Bendis Noob actually shift bridging in Bedwars, because, like, I literally don't do this, like, 90%. <gasps> I'm so done. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'm not dead. All right, let's get this guy really quick. This guy. Oh, look at this clutch. Nice, let's go. So, yeah, um, so back to what I was saying, you have to be aiming at a specific point. Oh, this guy is actually really smart. He's not really going to care that I'm, yeah, I was trying to abuse the pick rider, but people are getting smarter, which is cool, I guess. By the way, for some reason, like, okay, I'm so bad today. I'm so bad. <laughs> Let's make our bridge over. Believe it, I'm actually concentrating. Okay, mid it. Okay, so uh, actually, speaking about incline god bridging, a lot of you has been have been telling me, oh, Bella's new, why don't you incline god bridging uh, bedwars? And you're like, oh, Bella's new, are so bad, um, you can't even incline god bridge. Actually, that's not the thing. The same thing I was talking about with god bridge first is consistency, and second, like going back to what I was talking about with god bridging, you have to aim at a specific point. Um, that's a huge part for you to practice, especially for incline god bridge. I recently started incline god bridge more, as you can tell, because I've been I've gotten a little bit better at uh, setting up my aim for incline god bridge um, So this is a really huge part with like god bridging after you got more consistent because like you can't like spend so much time Just fixing your aim in the natural bedwars game. You're just definitely gonna run in trouble Like people are still gonna be faster than you. This guy is definitely getting my bed on bruh um, So yeah, if you can't set up your aim in like three seconds, you know perfectly for god bridging or incline god bridging still don't use it like there are just so many things you need to make sure that you can do oh i made the correct decision this guy has so much loose on him so yeah you need to make sure that you can do all these things and then like god bridge and and then you know maybe you can start maybe god bridge rushing bedwars you know god bridging really isn't that easy you know like a lot of people has been telling me, oh, Bella's new, you make god bridging look so easy. Yeah, yeah, you know, from my perspective, of course, like I practice so much and um, it's literally uh, already a part of my muscle memory. So definitely for me. But for a lot of you guys, yeah, I seriously do not recommend like using it in like actual Bedwars game because it could potentially give you like a disadvantage. I do get that, you know, it is a really cool thing to do. But yeah, if you're trying to play competitively, then may okay, well, this guy's just using Fireball. Then maybe not, maybe not. That's almost, you know, that's basically, okay, this guy's potting. Oh my god, panic, 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 panic. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, okay, he's potting invest. No, 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 no. And he's got diamond. Okay, okay, wait, no. Oh, okay, GG, GG's. So imagine this guy actually left, like, <laughs> this guy actually got away. So at last, we're gonna deal with this, um, the, the last guy, I guess. Well, you know, uh, for now, I'm just gonna finish this game because that's basically all I want to cover in this video. And right now, it's just me dealing with this last guy. I'm gonna actually buy a tracker just to so end the video. Um, well, I still hope that, you know, all this information I've talked about could be at least somehow helpful for you. So maybe you could... Alright, I guess that's GG. That's the second guy that just fell. Like, <laughs> okay, man. Alright, uh, anyways, thank you all so much for watching. And yeah, um... See you guys next time. Peace.